We're learning disturbing new details on what led to a young girl's body to be found inside a dumpster in southwest Miami-Dade. Investigators now say her mother killed her on Halloween. CBS 4's Riel Creighton is live at the apartment complex where the girl's body was found. Riel? Well, Elliot, this was just devastating for basically this entire community. Now, from outside this apartment complex, you can only see really what is a new dumpster in place of the one where that tragic discovery was made. Beside it now, there is also a small makeshift memorial there in honor of a four-year-old girl whose name we now know, Tania Page. Police say it was her mother who threw her away. I was up there watching everybody looking around and wondering and knowing that your baby's in the garbage. This woman didn't want to show her face, traumatized after what she now thinks she witnessed this past weekend. The woman in the apartment across from her throwing out what she thought was trash. Because she backed up her car and everything. And I was like, well, it's weird that she's backing up her car to throw away garbage. Four-year-old Tania Page, her tiny body discovered in this dumpster by another resident throwing out garbage. Police arrested the little girl's mother, 31-year-old Tina Farrington, charged with murder. This neighbor, once again, watching. All of a sudden, you could see her coming down the stairs, handcuffed. But she was like, okay, like if nothing was happening. like. No remorse whatsoever. Police say Farrington killed Tania on Halloween, according to the complaint, angry that she was talking back to her. So she suffocated her with a pillow, then stuffed her body in the trunk of her Nissan. Detectives say days later, after discovering a foul odor, took her daughter's remains to the trash. I find out that the trash that I put in had gone on top of a child. Now, an entire complex shell-shocked about what happened here. A happy four-year-old who they used to see running around and playing outside all the time, and a mother who they believe did the unthinkable. And now you know who the baby is, and that's when it hurts more because she's right here. She was right here all the time. How can you do that to your baby? Police say that little Tania had bruises on her body, her arms, her legs, her upper body. They say that her body was already in the early stages of decomposition and that her mother confessed to her murder. We're live in Southwest Miami-Dade, Riel Creighton, CBS 4 News.